What is up, everyone? We are back. This is College Street. We're coming back here with another one. Uh, 20, 21. 21. Awesome, 21. guys. Okay, 20, so 21. this is 21. our very first video podcast. So it's it's history, groundbreaking right now. What we are doing for you Legendary. guys is we will be uh, playing the first few, you know, twenty minutes. Yeah, we're we'll, giving we'll, you a teaser. We're giving you some stuff. We're a, teasing a you visual, a, a visual effect. <laughs> And so then uh, you guys can watch this. It's on YouTube. Come yeah, um, check it out. Exactly. If College Street. Look it up. And uh, then if you want to listen to the rest of it, you can go back and hit it on the podcast. iTunes. On iTunes, Stitcher, Sp- Spreaker, Spreaker. Uh, SoundCloud. Um, Everywhere. But Spotify. Yeah, all over the place. College Street. Yep. Check it out. Thank okay. you. Okay. <laughs> all right. Thank um, you. We're going to get rolling with this today. Um, Hamad. What's new with you, dude? Uh, what's new with me? So, well, lately the weather's been super cold and everything. Right. right? So, we're, like, no, we. A we, blizzard has hit us, right? Oh, yeah. It's, well, it's, it started it's, it's out like this the, week. It's at like the like, second ice age. Like you can just go agree with that. 35 degrees. <laughs> so, <Ice Age>, too. <laughs> and then the within a down. day, it dropped all yeah, that, so, like, like, uh, down to zero. So, the parking lots and everything is super slick. So, right. like, I was going to class today. I'm, like, backing up. And, like, there was a pile of snow I didn't see. So, like, I backed up. And then I was in a hurry because I was going to be late. So I just ran straight in the snow. Nice. And, and like, my my front driver's seat didn't defrost. So I had, like, a sheet of ice. So I was kind of, like, driving blindly for about four, four feet until I got stuck. Nice. And then I got stuck for, like, ten minutes. I'm just, like, freaking out. And, like, I couldn't get out. And it turns out, you know, the mailman was happening to be at my mailbox. Just And? And he, he helped me out. Was, uh, how did he help you out? How did he help you out? <laughs> he, got, he had his, he put on his gloves and he was just like, all right, we're gonna start rocking this car. And I'm just like sitting in the driver's seat. And then just like, pushed you out. Yeah, I was just in reverse, just gunned my car out. The mailman saved the day. So yeah, shout I, out to that mailman. I, I, I was uh, stuck. I got stuck the other day too, and someone. Yeah. It was in a parking lot. Right. They like pushed all the snow. You know, they were shoveling yeah, snow. Yeah, and yeah. They pushed all of it in this one area, and I was racing to find a spot. And there's another car, and we're we're going for the spot, and we see mm-hmm. it, and I just rammed into it. And little did I know, my car is not that high. Yeah. And there's way more snow than I thought. I got stuck, and then, and then I get out. I'm like, oh, shit. So I ch- so I try to push it out, and then that With car. No, that, that, nobody in the driver's seat. Well. No, I try to back up. <laughs> oh, okay. It's irrelevant. The, the, yeah, yeah. The guy leaves, and then I'm trying to get out. I'm reversing back and forth, digging my wheels out for five minutes. This is before class. So I'm already right. Some guy, some guy pulls up. He's like, you need a hand, buddy? And I'm like, I'm like, sure. He's like, you'll leave a spot open. Because he thought I was leaving, but I was just trying to get in. He's like, no, I'm just trying to. So then I'm like, yeah, help me. So he kept pushing, pushing. He's like, you're not getting out. It just goes and drives <laughs> off. <laughs> That's my story. So did you get it out or you just left it there? Uh, well, you I, called me. I, yeah, no, I went to class. I was like, and th- my car was sticking out like two sore thumbs. Not one, but two. So I just left, left it there, went Good. to class and come nice back. Nice analogy. Uh, yeah. And then I just dug it out myself. Okay. Nice. Yeah. Good. That's what it. about you, Dees? What's, yeah, what's what, what, you, you? what do you got? Um, well, not a whole lot's been happening. Uh, Recently, though, Alex walks into my room today and says, hey, so our our dishwasher has a whole bunch of water in the bottom of it. I really didn't know what was going on. He's like, yeah, it's like I was couple, completely aware. A couple inches of water sitting in the bottom of the wow. dishwasher. I, I thought he was talking like we had water all over the place, but not not that extreme. And so I thinking, OK, you just got to clear the garbage right. disposal and uh, then it'll shift through. But uh, not the case. We've uh, cleared the garbage disposal and we've ran cycles through the dishwasher and all it does is continue to put more and more water into the bottom of the dishwasher. So nothing's draining. And it's just a bunch of wait, soap and water. I knew it all along. So Alex you, knew it all along. So your dishwasher is still broken then? It's oh, broken. Yeah. It's so, been broken since you moved in now, though. Now here's right? So we're well, looking no, for a new place. <laughs> so we are looking for a new place. <laughs> now now let me place. tell you something. With stuff like this breaks, we have to put a maintenance order. Yes. Not call. We have to go online and do it on the website. Yes. Right? Um, so last time, I had to put one in for my light, right? Yeah, yeah. And it took him a week to respond to me. <laughs> so we're going to be without a dishwasher for, I'm predicting, at least two weeks. Hey, Alex, how many uh, Alexes does it take to change a light bulb? Uh, how many? Uh, I don't know. I just know that Alex calls people to do it for him. Oh, so, fuck so, wait, 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 wait. So <laughs> you're saying you. that the whole time when, when you climb through the wall to fix your light, you just didn't change the light bulb? No, 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 no. Yeah, okay, he, okay. he climbed right. through the wall. Hold you on. were just like, I can't. I, he's like, your light bur- uh, your light wasn't working. You're like, he thought it was like the switch or fuse or something like that. Okay, so I was in the wall light bulb or what? The lights started flickering, and I went to work. I come back, they're they're, they're off. Yeah, they yeah. don't work. The switch doesn't work. So then I 
I got a fresh light bulb and I screwed it into each one and turned the lights back on and off with each one. Nothing. Right. So then I wait for the repairman to come by. You put in your order. I yeah, put in my yeah. order. A week later, uh, they said, okay, tomorrow we'll get someone. The dude comes and I'm waiting for, I'm upstairs. I'm playing darts. I'm waiting for him. He, he walks up after about a minute. He's like, yeah, dude, you just got to replace your light bulbs. I'm like, oh, really? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh, really? Guy got, got new light bulbs? <laughs> oh, you don't say. <laughs> got new light bulbs? <laughs> works, works, like, works like new. So, so then, uh, how? Why did you say you you tested them with the new ones and they didn't work? I well, did. I also told him like, well, how do you explain the flickering before they went off? He's like, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't have an explanation for it for the flickering. So did you pay him? Did you have to pay him and everything for that well, service? Or well, well, it's the uh, it's with uh, the uh, property uh, management okay. area we're with. That's still funny though. Nice. It's hilarious. Yeah. <laughs> well, good as cool. new. He's probably the easiest job he's ever done. <laughs> probably yeah I just probably told easiest, you to yeah. change your life you should give him a tip it. okay <laughs> well good um, we're gonna kick you off rolling today guys uh, kick you off yeah. yeah we're kicking you off I don't know I, I find myself saying that a lot I don't kick. know is it is it because I'm a soccer player is it all Wait, about kicking, kicking you off? Yeah, like, uh, like getting off. Kick it off, you know? Like, no, not <laughs> get that's off not related. Where do you get off? <laughs> it's uh, kicking off. Anyways, you know? what's, 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 the, you kick what's off? the topic you're trying to kick off, these? Online yeah. dating, Hamad. Online I, I want to know. That's not applicable to me at all. <laughs> <laughs> I want to know the do's, the don'ts, and the success stories. Well, no, this is not dating. recent. This could be whenever. Whenever, yes. It could be back in elementary school. All right, hitting well, up was that a thing? MySpace online, is a thing, you know? but online slide. dating and yeah, and when you online dating has been yeah, around. So on, like on MySpace, you, like for you personally. Yeah, I, I don't online know, dating through he, Facebook. I don't know, like shit. So you've dated through Facebook? Yeah. How? I think, so. I think every person has, like tried to date through Facebook. I gotta start right? Facebook, but yeah, go on. I don't okay. know. You Explain. slide into some girl's <laughs> messenger. I'm just DM. Kidding. Yeah, DM. Direct messenger. Yeah, that's all no, right. actually, Facebook is just messenger. It is. It's called the messenger uh-huh. app. But uh, I, I want to know about it. Tell, I, tell me the stories. Really dated off of. Well, it wasn't name. like uh, I just started. It was like a relationship that happened, but then it was long term. So they ended up messaging through <laughs> no, Facebook Hamad when I was is, like <laughs> in middle school or some shit. Hamad is one of those people that like you know those pictures where a guy sends yo what up to like fifty girls and he yeah. thought they'd send separate and he sends it. <laughs> it's a group <laughs> to file. The same group yeah, file. and then he's like what up to like fifty people and they're like. Long shot. He yeah. went for the Hail Mary there. <laughs> oh, well. that I think that's about the only experience I've had. I think I've had Tinder for like one week, and then I, I deleted it because... You don't have Tinder still? No. I feel like it, I'm not... I, I'm really bad at dating social... I Why? Feel like there's a, there has to be a talent or what, something. What are you doing wrong? I'm... DC, if I knew, I'd, I'd still have <laughs> yeah, bro, That's a good point. She's okay. okay. Well it. said. Um, but what, what, do you, what do you normally do? Like... In terms yeah. of date, online, online dating? dating, yeah. Uh, like, let's see, I just, let's, let's I just, pick it apart. Well, okay. what, what's your, well, what's here, your here, go-to here, 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 Here's what I do. Yeah, I, I just, you know, I sign in a Tinder, and they're like, oh, you sign in, make up a, make up a name, right? Yeah. And then you no, go, no, no, no. <laughs> okay, we want to go further. Then we get it. You make accounts. <laughs> and then, then we don't just, know how to make just follow the accounts. tutorial, and that's all I do. So are you the one that that puts all the uh, the senior pictures and the ones that nah, you don't I look like at all? Or do you try to be as authentic as possible? I just usually take old photos, you know. Okay. Okay. That's about it. Um, when I do get a match, I usually say hi. And That's usually, it. I don't usually get a text back. <laughs> well, uh, there's your problem, Mom. You gotta. One time I was like, I... dude, I tried it. I, one time I was like, hey, you like Harry Potter? So do I. <laughs> you know, I, got blank, I got a blank space after that. I was like, shit. Did, thought, did they reply? No, I thought I was. I thought uh, we were on the level. So I, I, I feel for you. I think, I think they just see my brown face and they're just like, new. Yeah, well, but they matched with you. Yeah, I don't know, dude. Wow. I got a actually I got a few ways that gets your replies. Okay. Every single time. Okay. There's two go tos I do. Okay. What are they? Both of which I saw somewhere and I, I didn't come up with these. First one is you literally just say you're my dream girl, but spell it right. You're spell it right. No dot or anything. Just send that. Right. Just straight up compliment. You're you're my dream girl. Got Nothing it. else. They respond right away. Why? What do you mean? Of like with what? Thanks. They respond with your thanks or like the like right back at you or. Or something like explain why or just some shit like that. Well, oh. think about it, Hamad. If a girl messaged you and was like, hey, you're my dream guy. Yeah, I'd you, probably leave. 
Really? Oh, that's what? Kind of creepy, okay, dude. then there's your issues because you're not. Having... <laughs> it just came out of nowhere. I'm like, just afraid to get catfished. <laughs> um, I see everything. You're I afraid like, to get I hurt. I see a, a hundred different perspectives. I'm like, well, I mean, was she was she drunk when she wrote this? Uh, <laughs> what state of mind was she in? Okay, um, you way over. Uh, uh, Amaya just doesn't is... believe it. He's like, there's no way a woman would I don't say that. I believe this, <laughs> and then I just delete the app and then just like leave my phone at my house for a couple hours and. Then, Okay. Yeah. Right. Well, yeah. well, that that's my first approach. That, okay, that's second, the one. Okay. That's the one I've been okay. using. I don't use those like pickup lines or anything because I feel like those lead nowhere. I don't think the pickup lines lead anywhere. I think I think jokes and types of riddle pickup lines. Or if you get if, places, if you use their bio. But I I just stopped doing that. I literally now just say that. Or I started doing this new thing where I say hey and I insert their name, hmm. and and then and then they respond with hey what's up or whatever. And then you're like hey you're cute. And then after that, you say, oh, you guys are so hold, on, hold on, why, why do you talk about it as like it's an algorithm? Like, hey, variable X and every X you reinsert. See, this is why I don't like online dating. That's why exactly. Why don't you ever have a conversation with someone in like real time like you're supposed to? What, what do you mean? Hold on, hold on, hold on. You, you know? guys didn't finish the, my, the thing. Okay. What, what was your algorithm? The, what, I'm I was going to say, I haven't, this, I literally just, just saw this the other day and I started using it. Okay. So, so this I'm is sorry. brand new and I've not had a chance to try it. But. I actually tried it once. Okay. Like, I'm, I'm, in, I'm in the process okay. Okay. right now, okay? I'm in the process right now. So you say, hey, whatever their name is, and they say, hey, what's up? Or then you'd be like, hey, you're cute. Then whatever they respond, you'd be like, hey, you want to go get a drink? Or you want to go get coffee? Or do you want to go get breakfast? And then lead it from there. No tender conversation. I saw... Yeah, uh, that's actually pretty... I, I like that. I saw actually. Andrew Hales. You guys know that is? Law yeah, 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 yep, yeah, yeah. That's what He's doing like that, a podcast. Uh, his well, podcast. Uh, yeah, I mean, Just that's straight not, up to the point. Well, that's how you should, but that's, I'm that's in the like, process of trying to do that. Like, that's how you should do it in real life too, though. Like, if you like someone and you feel like there's a chemistry, you should be yeah, like, yeah. hey, do you want to go get... I completely agree. Exactly. Well, see, it's not an algorithm. It's just like... It's just being direct. It's right dude. to the point. Yeah. Okay. I was just commenting on the hey, insert name. So, <laughs> so I'll let you know how that goes. Yeah. All right. Let's so, okay. All right. DC, tell us your story. You're yeah. The well, one that has what's the your go-to? Um, yeah. You're right. He does have a success story. All my story, all my so. go-tos would be leading out with like a joke or a riddle or just something to kind of riddle me this. Bring attention. You can't leave until well, you do you like this. Mustangs? No, not like, to that extent. It, uh, it was like, like one jazz. of them. <laughs> one of them was uh, what? What's a good one? That's a good one. Like jazz. I play the saxophone. You like I, I did. I just uh, oh, ba- very saxophone. But uh, anyway, <laughs> my one of my jokes was like uh, something st- stupid. Like, what do you get when you cross a river and uh, a stream? Your heart. Wet feet. That's that's kind of that's kind of serious though. It's, right? it's cheesy, you know. Like it's just kind of like <laughs> wet feet. Yeah, because you, your feet are. Oh, wet I was thinking now. of cold feet for some reason. <laughs> no, I'm not you gonna <laughs> cold feet. <laughs> not even. I actually had the same thing. <laughs> yeah, you I'm guys need to. I, I, I had the same thing in my head. Because like, when your feet are yet. wet, they're cold. So I don't know. I thought yeah, that's I what thought, you meant. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Whatever. So so are their feet wet when they respond or what? Uh, yes. What do they usually say back? They're just like, oh, haha, cute or funny wow. or, or I, I get something and then, and then sometimes I can get awful. somewhere like, <laughs> that's the point. It's just kind of a little bit of an icebreaker kind of. Wait, that's your beginning? Now you're. Yeah, in. that's my. What do you mean? You don't end with a joke. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's like, that's all I got to do. need to break the ice at the end. Just like <laughs> jump in the water. How much does a polar bear wear? Enough to break the ice and then just end the conversation. <laughs> <laughs> Look, thanks for talking to you. Yeah. Goodbye. Goodbye. No, that's. Uh, okay, that, that what about your relationship? Now, I don't know if you mind sharing this, but what was the first thing you said to okay. your girlfriend? It was, it was actually that joke. Well, oh, oh shit, Jesus. really? Yeah. Take oh, notes, Jesus. ladies and gents. So, um, oh, what was it? I'm going to use it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> what do you cross? Uh, uh, what do you get when you cross a river and a stream? Quick. I'm not going to use it. I don't Never mind. That I'm joke I'm not it's it's I don't like get it either. in a joke setting where somebody would say, what do you get when you cross a chicken and a house or, or just something stupid or it's like you cross two make. items, you know, how yeah, like but I'm when you to, mix I'm it two. I'm trying to figure out how cold what, feet comes out of stream. It's not and, cold yeah. feet. It's <sighs> wet feet. I'm trying to figure it's, out it's, how, what okay. is wet feet. You, stop. <laughs> Let me explain. Okay. What do you get when you get across a river and a stream? It's like crossing two objects. Yeah. Okay. In the the joke is that you literally cross the river oh, and the stream, so you walk across it, oh, and shit. so then you get wet did, feet. Yeah, did you tell not me, cold is, feet? Is that what you it's call? not you're walking away. You're not getting nervous or anxious. Is you that get, is that what you did? Is that how you had to explain it to her? Because I I no. understand that. So she understood, she understood it. it. Well, how long did it take her to reply? How long did it take her to understand? Uh, it? She res- she replied immediately because she actually like um, th- this is the thing that she's is on it was on bubble. 
And so she messaged Bumble. you first. Bumble. Once, once you match. That's oh, the, you're right. That's and so she idea. messaged you first. And so then I led with the joke. She said, hey. And then I was like, okay, well, I'll actually have a conversation. And so I gave her the riddle or joke. Mm. And uh, then she's like, oh, okay. This is what she told me later. She's like, okay, this one's an actual keeper because I'll actually talk to you. And so then she actually had conversations. Wait, she said that me. to you? Yeah, she told me this later, later on after uh, the success story. Hold on, hold on. Wait, mm. I'm confused. You just said... I'm saying she told me later on after I'm that, you, that that I actually gave her a riddle. I actually gave her a conversation instead of just saying hi or, or just doing something I see. blatant. It was unique. Exactly. And so she remembered me and she immediately wanted to talk to me more and actually that's get to cool, know who dude. I was. Well, and that's why I'm saying is that's, that's how you can go. have success is so by he's, actually he's the doing successor, something. You're the schemer and I'm the failure. <laughs> <laughs> no, thing. hold on, hold on. Do you see, uh, maybe now, but like I used to message girls all the time. Like yeah. in high school, like when I figured out about Messenger, I yeah, literally, yeah. sophomore year, I'd message girls literally every fucking day. Like I just go on Messenger and whenever girls are have a little circle and I- The little green, you're just like, like hey, girl, girl, line. Not everyone, but I know, like I'd see a girl- <laughs> like goes and down I, the line. Like I'd see a girl, exactly. <laughs> Who's I'd online see, right now? I'd like over a thousand friends. So like whenever I'd see someone, I'd just be like, okay. And I and I literally just say, hey. And then most of the time in, in high school, um, they just go, hey, and then you start a conversation and it leads to I you feel dating. Like that's kind of crazy, right. bro. Online dating, that is. Like you, yeah. it, because most of the time they're from another school. Right. You know what I mean? So then you talk, you talk, you date, and then what you about, break up. What about what about those, uh, just a quick change of like topic, I guess. It's like, what about those people who date within video games? Have you heard about that? Like people who like 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 I'm talking just like PC gamers though, like or like Twitch, or like Twitch gamers. Yeah, find somebody online who, and who and like just, de- who date. Yeah. Through it. I think that's I don't weird. recommend. Wait, wait, date through it or do they just do that as a hobby together? No, Both. like they they like meet someone over like on a video Twitch. game or like through online and stuff. Nah, it's just fucking and adorable. Just Are you guys kidding me? They both no, thank story. you. No, what what do you mean? Do you see if I'm they're both in doing the same thing and then they meet and they're into each other? Like, let's say for example, you you're on Fortnite duo single and it's some chick just gets on your chat with you and you're like and you guys win what do you do <laughs> oh see okay, I, I guess like if you if it's just a random person yeah yeah that's, that's that, that, i think it's weird because you don't know how they look you don't that's know that's what i'm saying but that's what people they, do. they, they keep and, and how do you do. even know that they live and, in your and, you and, and, yeah that's the thing and they, they could be they on the other side of the world but they like date virtually for like months nice and then sometimes they would actually meet but like one of my favorite youtubers uh he met his whatever fiance wife i don't know girlfriend girlfriend yeah jesus christ what was that i don't know yeah, it's just triggered his, interjected his, his girlfriend on um whatever it is on twitch? Tw- on twitch or somehow i don't they're both like twitch stars hmm. or no she's a twitch star but he twitched for a little bit he's a youtuber but i'm talking yeah i don't know i feel like that's just kind of a i think it's just weird i feel like it makes the relationship super superficial i agree a little bit. Well, perhaps. I, I don't know. I've not Who happened not, to me. One would find out. But Anyways. speaking of this dating, let's lead into Valentine's Day. This Valentine's. week, Valentine's. This week Valentine's. is Valentine's Day. It is on Wednesday. Yep. And uh, so I was going to ask you what you guys would be doing for Valentine's Day. But you see, you uh, know me what if we talk I, about I, the most I, romantic thing we've done? Because yeah. me, because literally I'm, I'm going to school. I'm not doing nothing. Okay. Okay, what's the most romantic thing you've done on Valentine's Day? We'll go with... Can we go with you first? Yeah. Okay. I'm trying to think of a story. Go with you first. Well, I don't really have necessarily What are you going to do on Valentine's Day? For my current relationship, this would be the first Valentine's Day. Uh, Oh, shoot. That's going to be a big one then. since it's a long-distance relationship, uh, I won't be able to see her on Valentine's Day. But you guys will FaceTime the whole day? Uh, no. You're Skype the whole day? Uh, Not the whole day. Maybe... You'll have like uh, Omegle the whole day? No, not the whole day. Because you got Not you got to do stuff. Just no, 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 no. You got responsibility. You know, DC, what you, this is what you got to do. You got to get you got to get like Apple earpods or whatever, something that has headphones in, and you guys just have a call that lasts like twelve Bluetooth hours call. straight. What if you just send your drone there? Oh, that's even better. <laughs> that's too far, dude. I only got that four mile range. You DC, know? get a booster signal for it. Send no, it I don't like think it 60. goes six thousand or six hundred miles. Well, DC, you didn't buy the right drone. You got to buy a Predator drone next time. I will. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> What do you have? 34 grand Yeah, but the what? I have a Mavic Pro. That's the Logan Paul one, right? <laughs> Probably. What? Do <laughs> you want to be a Maverick? <laughs> <laughs> but success stories, failure stories, Valentine's Day for you guys. What do you got? M- like most romantic thing I've done. Okay, yeah. Because for me, literally just like that one time. I've been <laughs> single Valentine's Day every single year except one year. Okay. And that year, I guess what I did is I got like... I was willing to spend money back in high school. Like I was, damn, you've been making like, bank then. I you? was making a lot of money for a high schooler, but um, yeah, I remember I got flowers, candy, 
a card, a huge one of these huge bears. Oh, the plush ones you get for like fifty bucks or some shit. And then roses. Nice. And then I I get, I go up to the door to uh, to whatever say hello to like get her out to go on the, and then we're going on a date that okay. night. But like I go up and I can barely hold this. I didn't think about how much like hands I had. Well, only you two. You bought a lot of things. I bought a lot of stuff. I had a shopping whole, cart. Wow. Yes. No. So I had to hold like the bear and, and then the you have everything. And yeah. Just standing in the door. That's the most romantic thing. I've that's done. actually that's pretty good job, good Alex. She must yeah. have been pretty happy when she opened the door. Uh, You're just prob- like probably not. Go ahead. <laughs> Damn, that's savage. Uh, I think, oh, shit. Um, let's see. Uh, for the Valentine's, I got her like a uh, candy bar. <laughs> no, she baked me. I just remember she baked me um cupcakes, and those cupcakes were actually fucking fire. What kind of cupcakes? Red velvet? No, they were they were just like they had like blue frosting, and they were just like white cake or something. And I just remember when I ate them, I was like, wow, these are some good ass cupcakes. And then I got her like a uh, stuffed animal. Or something like that. I think it was just a stuffed animal and like some other gift cards and stuff like that. And I nice. Think. But I think she did it better than me because she actually she got like my she got cupcakes and then she painted a picture. With the cupcakes? No, with with the with paint. Oh, oh, shit. that was the Valentine's. Well, and then we went on a date, above and beyond. It, but moving above and beyond. Yeah. yeah. Well, I, I, thought, I think that was it. But that was like my only Valentine. Maybe the next few years so, yeah. will be better and more successful Valentine's Days for you guys. Well, not this year, though, right? <laughs> not not this year. I, next year, maybe. Hopefully. Wait, Cross your fingers. Is it this Tuesday? Uh, it's actually on a Wednesday, the 14th. I have an exam that day anyway, so... <laughs> bad luck. But yo, no, maybe no, no, you can no, meet no. the your dreams Exactly. you got to just chill outside your exam room and then wait for everybody that comes out. And you pick that one girl that's just like, oh, that was... A bad exam, like I didn't do so well, and, and then, then you're and like, then ask hey, her to marry you. Right I there. want to cheer you up. Let me tell Would you something. You go to coffee with me. This this class is roughly guy to girl ratio is a hundred to one. So, yeah, uh, I think there's I like think two. So. I think including the, the I think including the instructor, it's one girl in that class. I'll ask the instructor. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> good, good thinking. Flawless. I'm on. Him. So but I think I, she's I, taken, but yeah. Well, who you, knows? you never know. You if you don't shoot, you don't score. Well, these, yeah, I guess okay. I guess that's what, that's true. Yeah. Whatever, dude. Come on, tell me what about the, this story because I I have a similar story to you. Uh, seats and lectures, you know, they're yes, kind of. I did mention this. They're kind of like yes, unassigned yes. seating, but it's it's kind of like after the first four well, weeks. Yeah. Okay. So you sit in the well, same this, seat. Well, this this idea got stemmed through a through a situation I was in. So I was I was we have I have my first class in the morning is at ten o'clock and it's circuits. Right. And the problem is. The class is leveled. Like, the floors are even, okay. but there's, like, 50 ki- or like 40 kids in that class. Okay. So, like, if you're in the back row, you can't see. You can't see shit at no. all. At all. Right. So, uh, basically, the first... You have to get there early, too. Like, class starts to at 10, seat. but you gotta, you gotta be there, like, 15 minutes early to get a seat. If you're there even before, like, maybe five minutes before class starts, you're stuck in the back. Okay. So, it's basically an animal. Jungle. Well, here's the thing. Though, in the back, the, it's row. not raised. Like, most right. long yeah, classrooms, right. yeah, right. most classrooms in that building are raised, but right. this is the one. But that's what I was saying. It's like and it's just long it's and flat. Narrow. So, so yeah. So, the last couple of days, I've been sitting in this, like, kind of there's my designated seat. I'm going to say, quote, unquote, right? Designated right. seat. Cause, and then, finally, you know, like, I, I was late for, like, maybe I was maybe a little later than two minutes of my usually time. Taken. I had to sit, like, six or seven rows back. Well, that here, sucks. It made me mad, but, I mean... I, I always sit in the back, but yeah. I like the back. The thing is, the first few days there was more people in the class, so it was right. even far. You had to sit even mm-hmm. farther back, and people started sitting on top of desks. People, <laughs> people were but, standing up. People were standing up on their on their chairs, and it became a mess. People started flying everywhere. Everyone started falling. Desks there's flopping fights over. There's happening. People trying to get their. There's too much too much okay, noise no. for the professor. No, I'm serious though. People started like flying, like they started falling off. I remember a girl yeah, yeah, once yeah, tipped actually, over a tipped, desk. Tipped the desk, and then they just shit. started s- actually s- sitting down in the chairs, like they would sit. Do you know what I mean? But then like, like the chair and the up, table right? are, are yeah, connected like there. up or whatever. Yeah. But yeah, so then that came the idea. They gave me the idea of just assigned, unassigned, or you took my unassigned lecture spot. Right. That's what I was thinking. I was it's, like, it's a like smaller lecture because it just happened to because me. Because it, it's, it's it's just kind of a small classroom and it's a small lecture, but you want that seat. Right. And then the end of the day, it gets taken. See, for what my story, do? is the other day we were going to the one class in uh, the one building. It's a pretty sizable lecture hall, and. Uh, we always sit in the back corner, like all six of us. We're always in the, these back two rows, and we're always right next to each other so we can kind of talk and interact, you know, during class and, and help each other out. And uh, our, Intermingle. Our, our one friend sure. gets to his normal spot and kind of gets to a few of the mm-hmm. spots around him. And uh, then we show up, and these two people were sitting right in the seats where I always sit every day for like the past four weeks. 
And so we had to sit a couple rows away, and it was just maddening because it's like, come on, it's we sit there. Maddening, dude. Yeah. It's frustrating. It was because it's like I sit there every time, and I. But the thing is, there's some classes where it doesn't matter. You're right. Like it in doesn't. chemistry, there's like five, like there's like 150 kids, but or like 200 kids in our class, but there's like 300 seats open, so it really doesn't matter. You're like, right. You but sit. it's it's still a little frustrating. But, but still, okay. Yeah. Even in those big lecture halls, you usually sit in the same spot. Right. That's right? what I'm you saying. Still yeah. The which same is spot. Isn't that crazy? Yeah. Just like. But then that huge lecture hall, people was kind of sit in the same. Well, spot. I was today actually. This happened today. A wild story. Uh, so me and my friend were going to sociology, and then we just sit. It's this like ha- half circle room. Yeah. Like it curves and it just slants yeah, down. Yeah, yeah. So. And we usually sit on like the left side, or I'm sorry, the very right side. And then today I'm like, hey, let's switch it up and go to the like left Ooh. side. So then we go down. <laughs> we we right. walk over there and sit down. And we're like, wow, uh, this this is different. And I look over. I'm like, dude, look, we could see where we sit every day. <laughs> And uh, you took somebody else's seat. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Def- yeah, that person's probably. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> Giving you a stink eye or whatever. But, well, yeah, that's, I don't know. What's your guys' tips on conquering that problem? Um, You put uh, tax down. Or <laughs> Every day you leave. Or you just threaten the guy that's in your seat. And you mark like, your territory. You actually just piss Hey, if, just if you don't time. move, I'm literally going to throw a fit. And uh, yeah, it's not, not going to be well from, that's from exactly either of what us. You do. And start, like, breathing and sweating. <laughs> Just, uh, yeah, just act autistic so then they get scared. <laughs> <laughs> you're just like, well, just well like, <laughs> take it easy. <laughs> take, <laughs> take it easy. Draw on the line, bro. <laughs> hey, crossing the line. I'll, crossing. I'll try it out. See, I'll let you guys know how that works. Sounds good. But well, anyways, yeah, that's, 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 that's my two bits for this topic, so... Well, we're going to wrap up the uh, video portion of today. Uh, if you would like, there to is hear more. more. There yes. is more. We're there will be going. more. If you'd like to hear more, uh, go check us out the podcast, the actual listening podcast on uh, whatever iTunes, Stitcher, Spreaker, yeah. SoundCloud, what, whatnot. Definitely. And uh, for you listening on the podcast, this portion of the video is on YouTube. If you want to see how we look, yes, check it out. Um, Please, not like you guys check our Instagram or anything. Right? Right. Well, <laughs> our Instagram isn't connected, so I don't think they do. Know. But, uh, All right. Know. So uh, yes, it's College Street. That is the page. Uh, look for us. We got our, our little logos in the background. Should and, we start uh, doing shout outs to people? To, to whom? whom? To we're not. We're not. <laughs> to, we might to start doing shout outs later. To, to <laughs> whom? So okay. Well, yes. yeah. If you leave a comment and ask a legitimate question, we'll say your name. Yes, and and please like, review like and uh, give us suggestions yes, on what you would like to hear. Really. That no, I'm just saying. Uh, boom, like, that, 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 that'd be that'd be the shout out you get. Yeah. So, anyways, leave us uh, comments, uh, questions, reviews, um, anything you'd like to hear. That'd be awesome. Let us know on all nice. your feedback. So, uh, yeah, we'll see you guys later. Later. Bye. Rub a dub dub. All right. That was-